The Matter of Life is a new pro-life film that seeks to share and educate viewers about the truth behind abortions. The documentary film emphasizes the humanity of the unborn child through expert analysis and facts. It also features powerful stories from women, former abortion clinic workers, historians, and religious leaders. The film will hit theaters for two nights on Monday, May 16th, and Tuesday, May 17th. Joining us now via Skype is Tracy Robinson, director and producer of The Matter of Life. Tracy, thanks for joining us. Can you tell us about your journey, how you went from being pro-abortion to pro-life, and how your experience moved you to work on this film? Yeah, so I, uh, in 2016, I was doing videos for a preg pregnancy resource center in California, and I was in the mushy middle, um, but I loved what the center was doing to help women uh, with their unplanned pregnancies. And it wasn't until my friends at the pregnancy center invited me to an apologetics conference, and the topic was the case against abortion. And in less than two hours, the message uh, just clarified for me the, the true humanity of the unborn child. Uh, from the moment of conception and the 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 whole um, uh, reality of what abortion does really struck me. Mm. And so I immediately felt compelled to make a documentary uh, because I knew there were so many people in my shoes, uh, young adults who had never heard the message before clearly. And uh, they grew up in public schools, uh, even went through church, and um, uh, and their family never broached the topic. Uh, and so they've just never heard it from these sources, mm. and they've just allowed the culture to uh, inform them and shape their worldview. Uh, so I had so many questions when I learned, finally learned the science. I wanted to know how we got to this point in our society. I didn't know anything about Roe v. Wade or the truth behind Planned Parenthood, nothing. Mm. Um, and I was an evangelical Christian in my late 20s. And so I began to research and I started to find these amazing stories um, and uh, learned about Roe v. Wade and uh, learned about the amazing multifaceted pro-life movement. And so I wanted to take others on this journey with me. Mm. And what do you want viewers to take away from the film? Well, I want them to take away that every life is valuable, that the circumstances uh, of that pregnancy that surrounds that pregnancy uh, do not uh, trump or are not greater than the life itself. Um, and so every life is valuable. That's what I want uh, people to come away with. Mm -hmm. This film is a great tool. This is a great tool to inform and inspire people. Mm. And you all really covered the scope of abortion and this whole debate in the film. You're sharing with me that you learned a lot that you didn't know during the process, but what was something that particularly surprised you that you learned? Well, I learned uh, what really surprised me midway through producing this is four out of ten women who've attended church, uh, who've had an abortion, were attending church in the month they became pregnant. And so uh, that was staggering to me to learn how many women in church are getting abortions. And uh, I shortly learned after that the statistic that over, well over half of all major Protestant denominations in the United States are silent on abortion, or they actually make ex exceptions for abortion. Mm. So it's no wonder you have that four out of 10 women um, in church. Um, so I realized, wow, this, this movie, uh, could be a rallying cry for Christians and for churches to really uh, get to the front lines of this issue yeah. and be able to love their love their congregation 40% more. Mm, those are some devastating stats. It's important that you're bringing them to light. How can our viewers find tickets for the film as well as more details? Will they be able to watch it elsewhere after its release next week? Uh, they will. It'll eventually be coming to streaming and DVD, but we want people to show up in theaters because it's so important to communicate to theaters and to our communities that this is an a, a important, important topic that deserves our attention right now. Um, so they can go to matteroflife.org, not .com, but matteroflife.org uh, to learn more and find tickets in their area. Good to know. Tracy Robinson, director and producer of The Matter of Life, thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me.